If the previous birth control options weren't effective enough for you, the options covered in this video might be just what you're looking for. We're covering the options that are in the middle range of effectiveness, but come with some other great benefits. Hey everyone, my name is Dr. Graham Dersna. The next four birth control options that we'll cover in this video have a huge increase in their effectiveness at preventing pregnancy compared to the previous eight. These options are between 90 and 95% effective with typical use and over 99% effective with perfect use. The secret to their success is that these options contain hormones. Let's learn how that leads to pregnancy prevention. While you're watching, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. The birth control injection is one injection of medroxyprogesterone acetate, which contains a hormone called progestin. The brand name is called Depo-Provera, and it's often just called Depo. Progestin works by stopping the ovaries from releasing an egg, and it thickens the mucus at the cervix so that sperm cannot enter the uterus. It is very easy to use because it's one injection that lasts for three months, but requires going to the doctor to get a needle, so it's a little invasive. You cannot use Depo if you have a blood clotting disorder, breast cancer, liver disease, or are allergic to Depo. It is not hormone free. It will very often cause shorter, lighter periods and sometimes even stops the period entirely. An important health benefit is that it decreases your risk of endometrial and ovarian cancer. The main health risk you might hear about is that it affects bone mineral density, which is how strong your bones are and a lower density can increase the risk of fractures. However, studies show that most, if not all of that loss of bone density is reversible when you stop using Depo. Some people experience side effects, but they often resolve once your body adjusts to the hormone. The two main complaints are irregular bleeding, such as heavier periods or spotting between periods, and weight gain. Once you get the injection, you don't have to do anything else. For three months, it is not reversible, but once it wears off, then your fertility will return, although sometimes it can take several months. And finally, it is private since only your doctor will know you received the injection. The birth control patch, pill, and ring are all very similar, so I'll explain them together, but you only use one, not all three. Like Depo, all three use hormones to stop the ovaries from releasing an egg each month and thicken the mucus at the cervix to prevent sperm from entering the uterus. They are very easy to use and not invasive. The patch is a sticker that you place on your body, usually your arm, lower abdomen, or butt, but never your breasts. You use one patch every week for three weeks, then no patch for the fourth week, which will cause you to have a period. Then you restart the process. The pill is a pill. You swallow one per day, and it needs to be the same time every day. The packet comes with four weeks of pills. The first three weeks contain hormone, and the final week does not contain hormone, so you get your period. The ring is a small plastic ring that is inserted into the vagina and remains there for three weeks to release hormone. Then it's removed in the fourth week, so there is no hormone, which causes your period. You cannot use these options if you are older than 35 and smoke, or have breast cancer, liver disease, high blood pressure, a blood clotting disorder, advanced diabetes, heart disease, or migraines with aura, which means a migraine with other symptoms, such as problems with your vision, numbness or tingling somewhere on your body, or being unable to speak properly. They are not hormone free. Using these options will give you a very regular monthly menstrual cycle, and the amount of bleeding might be lighter. Some benefits include helping to clear up acne, protecting against endometrial and ovarian cancer, and reducing menstrual cramping. They generally do not have health risks. Some people experience side effects, but they are mild and should resolve after you use that option for a couple months. The side effects might be breast tenderness, headache, nausea, vomiting, or irregular bleeding or spotting. You have to remember to use these options properly, either changing the patch every week removing the ring every three weeks, or taking the pill every single day. This is often the characteristic that determines if someone will use one of these options. If you don't think you can maintain the schedule, then these options might not be for you. They're completely reversible. You can become pregnant once you stop using them. 
they're all relatively private. Your partner will see the patch or may feel the ring and others may see your packet of pills wherever you store them. In the next video, we'll learn about the most effective birth control options. Thanks for watching. Now hit that subscribe button and like the video. Then check out this other video to keep learning.